Thanks, Max. This is our traffic control uh, some fixture, or red light as we like to call them, down here in the south. This is the whole assembly. This is our HMI that starts the, the process. This is controlled by Micrologix 1400 PLC. Two, two modules, our power supply for our HMI. Of course, the relays that control, uh, switch everything off and on. And the uh, five volt power supply. And this is how we start our control. This is our start program. So we're gonna start the program. And it's gonna go into the 40 second cycle that Max has already explained. The east-west is the busier street, so it has a 20-second green light. It switches over. Once it switches over, the north-south can go, but it's a much shorter time. Than the east-west. So, next I'm going to show you our crosswalks, of course, you can see those. The north-south has a seven-segment display that counts down from ten. And then it switches back. And then we have the crosswalk on the east-west. We have a counter right here on the HMI. So next I'm going to show you the turning sensor it's in a row for our turning lane. As you can see right now the light's green. The car pulls up when the light's green and activates it. Of course the light doesn't, the arrow doesn't come on immediately. We still have to go through the, the whole cycle and it's going to have to cycle back around. But when it cycles back around which is going to be in about 10 seconds. We'll wait patiently. So we got green light, yellow light. And then the, there's the turning arrow, which is 8 seconds. The car drives on. Light's red because the turning arrow is still activated. Once that turning arrow goes off, then you can walk. In a second, it counts it down so you know you're not going to get run over. So one of the other features we have is the simulated camera that catches people that run the red light. So now that the red light's on, you see a blue light on that says it's activated. Once a car, if a car tries to speed past, the light comes on indicating that it got you. And also on HMI, it says gotcha. I don't know if you can see that or not. The other feature that we have on our assembly this time is a night sequence because there's rarely any cars going up and down the north south street at 10 a.m. or 10 excuse me 10 p.m. the night sequence starts and we activate that with this on the HMI because we don't want to wait till 10 o'clock at night to show y'all this so what happens is it, it finishes up the cycle that it's on. And when, once it gets to the green light on the east-west, it stays this way. And it will stay this way all night long unless a car comes up and triggers a sensor for it to change. So, like I said, the stays this way i want to stay here just for a second so you know it doesn't change then say a car pulls up at 2 a.m and hits that sensor what happens is is it goes back to the original cycle 40 second cycle so the car sits there and it waits patiently 
Probably saying, why ain't this light changing? But then it will. It'll change after the 20 seconds. Now he goes. And then it goes back to the night sequence. Once that one cycles up. And it'll stay that way until another car comes up to the traffic light. And this is our project. Traffic light control fixture.